Hello and welcome to the live preview of uh, Trocardi version 0 0.3 and in this version the system got a complete overhaul of user interface now we have three sections data setup and dev in the data section we have events and profiles events are uh, the information that is coming from our website as you can see now uh, the new events are coming and uh, we can see the details of these events here you can expand here to see the uh, whole set of the information that was sent you can also click details to have even more information the same goes for profiles so these are the profiles created we can filter uh, filter the data right now we have a profile just one profile you can set a, a time range for example let's give it a 30 minutes till now so we have, you can see we have a lot of new profiles coming in the same goes for for sessions in the setup section we have sources this is these are the sources of our of our data basically it's just a um, javascript um, script that is pasted into your website and it sends events to the system rules rules are uh, some logic that is uh, triggered when an event comes to the, to the system so for example we have a, a logic here add to the list this is the name of the logic it's run in the scope group to it's tagged and it runs when an event type equals view you can see that all the events that triggered this uh, this rule have a uh, scope group to and uh, event type view and then it executes a, an, an action it adds a string to the list in, in the profile so uh, it, the, the profile property is x and the value added is 4 can just check it if it's uh, if it's uh, running so this is the uh, profile ID you can go to profiles type that the uh, profile ID equals ID we've just copied oh I can see that it didn't it didn't run in 30 minutes so we can give it like a minus one month here we go you can see that property X is a list and uh, on the first position there is four so you can see that this rule is working uh, okay we have uh, we can just browse this information what, what triggered this rule you can see uh, raw information from you know me you can see statistics how many times this rule was run and we can see the settings if the rule is enabled read only or any other information on that rule okay the same goes with segments you can also preview segments uh, we can add new rules this new form for adding rules so um, a rule is a um, kind of trigger it triggers when something happens so when an event event type equals identify identify you can see right now oh there is there are, there are some events three events within this month so where is this event type it identify you just expand it and see what data is coming when when you identify you can see that there's tar target properties email you want to copy it into the profile so let's go next let's copy it into the profile make profile property field PII email equal to our target properties email save it so when there is an event type identify then we run an action that copies a uh, target uh, properties email into personal information uh, dot email
email within the profile. Okay, now let's uh, say so in what scope we, we want to run it. I have a scope, scope to this is the name of a site. Uh, we can say that a uh, copy customer email. Just can tag it that this is personal information. You can give it a description. Okay, the, the description is optional. So we have a summary. Our neural is uh, copies um, customer email and it does it when an event type equals identify and then it runs this uh, this action okay save it uh, here we go there is where is uh, we can filter it scope crypto okay here we go this is this is our uh, this is our role it wasn't triggered by any uh, any events uh, by now you can see a raw data uh, in the Unomi, okay, statistics, no statistics because the rule was not run, and we have settings. The same goes with uh, with segments. You can get in at segments. Segments requires only uh, only a trigger. So when something happens, uh, we uh, we uh, copy a user into the segment. So we can say that there is an um, email personal information email exists well, we don't have any let's see what we have in the profile so uh, the number of visits is bigger than 10 we don't have any bigger than one we have four profiles Okay, next, let me give it a scope. Name. Okay. We have a summary. And here we go, we have a new, new segment called more than one. We, go. we can edit, duplicate, or delete the segment. Editing is just changing the segment. Yep. Now it's more than ten. Okay, now it's more than ten. Here we go, more than ten. Uh, we can duplicate this. Uh, duplicate this uh, segment. Just change it to. The Different version. Give it a different name. I just save it. So this is a, just a mm, quick way of uh, quick way of uh, making new segments. The same goes with rules. So rule can also be edited, duplicated, and deleted. Oh, okay, and we have a, a dev section. This is actually for developers and uh, backtracking or finding bugs uh, within within our configuration. We use Unomi query language here. So, for example, you can just browse uh, browse your event profiles, rules, and segments. You can create create uh, segments. This is all done from uh, from the user interface. Uh, didn't have to do it. You, actually, sometimes you can just um, debug if, if everything is working okay. So select uh, event. If you type it, you, you see a, a API call for you know me. And when you run it, you can see the response from the server. If there is an error, you know, for example, let's do it like this. See what's what's going on. This is not a valid JSON. Oh, here you go, there's an error. And you know, it doesn't actually return anything. It just goes it's an error. Okay, and that's it. 
If you want to su support us, just subscribe to our channels. That helps us a lot. Thank you.